Good morning, good people. It is 814. I've been up since 8 o'clock. I told hubby, I said, if you're up, wake me up at 8. And he did. Today is the 7th. I can't believe it is the 17th already. Fuck. All right. Light roast coffee from Green Mountain. I'm beginning to think, look at this. Just a regular fucking coffee, regular schmegular. I'm gonna drink it, but still. Ooh, makes me mad. Does anybody out here um, actually like dark roast? Oh, that shit is so bitter. It's so not good. <laughs> All right, today's color is gold, but uh, <clears throat> I need to see if I can work it in from my earrings. Um, I'm gonna try and get some editing done. So the mall opens at 11. So on Sundays. Taste the biscuits. Alright. I had an idea for that song on TikTok, but... It's gonna be for breezy. All right. I put in that peppermint stuff, which I do have more underneath of. Because I love me some peppermints. I do, I do. What do you want, Callie? Do you want a minnow? Do you want some treats? What do you want? Oh, where did my package go? I ordered more yesterday. Let me see, if I, can I get it in the trash can? <laughs> oh my, Luna, you were just eating. Did you? There's like no space, cause daddy has all the stuff on the counter. He went to a liquor store to get Christmas presents yesterday because I don't know if liquor stores are open on Sundays where everybody lives, but they're closed Sundays here. Most counties, there is one county that is open. Do you want some treats? Do you want some treats? Do you want some treats? Nixie, do you, do you want some treats? Nixie, do you want some treats? I love her reaction. Thank you, do you have a full tum tum? Okay. All right, well, now the gang is all fed. I actually got the video edited, your vlog edited last night. Edited it did. I got all that shit done last night. Go me. I mean, it was, I had to end up taking medicine to go to sleep because it was late. It was like, 
Let's see what time. I don't even remember what time I got upstairs. I got upstairs. I confirmed um, uh -oh, leaving time, wake up time, stuff like that. And then after thinking and I already got my outfit because we're all wearing our penguin leggings today. Um, like I said, today's color is gold. I could incorporate it somewhere. I'm sure I have something gold that I can throw into the mix. But, um, as I went upstairs and, like, just confirmed what all was happening today, um, hubby came in, we started talking, and then I was like, okay, when we were done talking, I got up and I took my medicine, so I can go to sleep. So, that was the end of that. I need to fill this, but I don't have time right now. So, so I will see you guys a little bit later on. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to vlog today because um, we'll be out, out the boat. So, we'll see. Hello, friends. Welcome to my other happy place. Um, we are fixing to leave here soon. Um, we are going Christmas shopping. Oh, yes, we are. Okay, so we are at Arundel Mills Mall in Maryland. Right now we're like in this toy shop. It's got like tons of Funko Pops and like toys and stuff. I found this with Brayden. So super cool. But yeah, so we're just walking around here looking. I don't know how much I'm gonna vlog because it is like freaking packed. Do you hear me? It is So we're taking a break. Wifey and best friend are in the store. I had to leave the store because I wanted everything in that store. Hubby's over there. Right there. <laughs> 
just, ow, your, bo- your bracelet was pinching me. Then my baby boy. Then my baby boy. Oh, Lord, here comes wifey. Party's over. What is up, folks? Oh, I was just telling my friends what is up. It is time for a Walmart grocery haul. I'm a wet rat. Oh my gosh, look at my eyes. It is like monsooning, pouring down rain right now. Right, Luna? Okay, quick Walmart grocery haul. Today has been an emotionally stressful day. Like, I cannot even. Like, I just... Other than best friend and Brayden, I just want to throw a punch everybody in the house. So that should basically narrow it down to who I want to throw a punch. Anyway, let's get to the grocery haul. All right, we got our bananas. I did not purchase this darling kitty from the grocery store, but she's here. So Walmart was like out. Their shelves were bare. So this was the only bread that they had that was any kind of keto friendly. And I got um, barbecue, or barbecue, car balanced tortillas. They didn't have any protein shakes, so they had one last peanut butter. I grabbed that, I'll do that this week. Um, Hubby needed Chef Boyardee, and just to save some bucks, I grabbed Brayden a case of oodles and noodles. I got, I changed brands, cause these were a little bit cheaper. It's the same thing, it's chickpea pasta. So we'll do that. I had, I got my bag of sunflower bacon crunch. It's got my sweet onion and citrus dressing. Oh my God, this dressing. They don't make it separately. They only make it with the damn salad kit. Okay, turkey breast for lunches, some cheese. These were on sale for $3.50. So I got two of those. I'm making chicken patties for dinner. I got heavy sun burritos some more cheese for charcuterie boxes. I got some brown rice and some jasmine rice. I got some smoked kielbasa. Um, I'm gonna make dinner with those. I got hubby two Salisbury steaks. Brayden, um, oh gosh, sorry, um, Thor. Uh, waffles for Brayden's. I got some buttery rounds for my video. Cottage cheese. Eggies, wifey's coffee, and then some garlic parmesan veggie fries. And then, of course, milk and half and half. I got these for hubbies. I'm going to make one of his bowls. You see what time it is, right? Do you see what time it is? Nine o'clock. And I think that's it. Oh, I stocked up on my waters and got my soda as well. So I did get those. But I'm gonna put everything away really quick. Um, it was just a literally like quick grocery shop. It's been me and Luna are gonna fight. So I'm so sad because I just realized I'm out of my red onions. So I can't put them in my lunch, my pickled red onions. So um, so I have my salad in here. I got the salad. I didn't add anything to the salad kit. I split the bacon up between the three bowls. I split the sunflower seeds. I'm going to add this Vidalia onion relish in here. And I actually might take, um, some cottage cheese. I used to take cottage cheese and put it in my salad with like two tablespoons of dressing. This comes with my favorite onion dressing, but I still have some of this cheese from making the elote uh, street corn, and I do not want it to go to waste, so I am going to put that in. I don't have any cucumbers or anything, but this does kind of remind you of a feta. So, like I said, I don't want this to go to waste, so I'm just going to put it in my salad. And it's nice because it just kind of gets, you know, whatever. And then I'm going to add some, I think I have another jar of this, I think. I need to learn how to make this because that might would be best but I'm gonna add this in my salad 
I'm the only one that eats this. It's so fucking good. And then with that onion dressing. Mm. Okay. Delicious. Hold on. Okay. So now I want to add some turkey breast. I'm just going to roll it up, chop it up like I normally do. Um, I don't make my lunches for the week in one night because I don't want my shit to get soggy and gross. So every night I'll, um, I'll pack my, I'll just put in my onion relish and stuff in and then because what I do is I just take a bit like that and then I just slice it up. Really thin slices. Not that you guys can really see. But I'll show you here in a minute. But yeah, so the start of our day, we left, we went to the mall. You should have seen the traffic that went to the mall. This is a Rundle Mills mall. There's like a casino and stuff all right there. It's like, if you're gonna go to a mall, that's the mall. It's like made up of communities. Like it says community one commit or neighborhood. It's like neighborhood one, neighborhood two. It's like a mile mall, like around, like you, but I couldn't even tell you how many miles I walked today. I'll have to check my watch. Okay. So this is how I cut my meat. It's just like a little, it looks like that. And then I just like separate it and throw it in my salad. Um, anyway, so the lines to get into the mall were insane. And so hubby's like, well, we're gonna take the back way. So that's what we did. We took the back way, we got into the mall, it was like kind of a shitty day weather-wise. Like it was raining and everything. It was just kind of a gross day. Ow, Luna, that was my damn finger. And uh, yeah, it was just an all route like gross day. And then hubby being grouchy to boot didn't help anything and I don't know. And then there was like a huge confusion about dinner because I thought we were getting honey baked ham like we got last time like for Thanksgiving and we are but it's for tomorrow and I'm like well I thought it was tonight because I didn't prepare anything for dinner because I thought we were gonna have that and then we would have plenty of leftovers but and then I was told what wifey had said about me behind my back I'm gonna tell y'all, I don't care. That I don't do anything. Because hubby was hungry today. Um, his fault. And that he didn't eat. Ooh, Luna. You okay? Um, so he was hungry. I gave him options of what we had. He didn't like any of those options, so he ate a, literally a pack of string cheese. He's been talking about his liver hurting, his kidneys hurting. He's worried about it being his spleen and stuff like that. Brayden, do your advent. Today is the 17th. I'm in a war zone. Ramp. Oh, uh, let me see. So he's got a snow ramp. Okay, here you go. Don't snatch. He snatched. That's good. Okay. Okay. Oh, Nixie. I don't have my long, I need a 30 inch chain, but my chain broke and I was also very upset because I like it nice and long. I cried on live stream when it broke. I had a panic attack because I have had this since many, many years, many, 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 many years. All right, let me um, scoop this up real quick. All right, so let me go ahead and do my advent cal. Better be, better have something in there today. The 17th. 
it is, it looks like an amber. Oh dear. It looks like an amber. I don't see half of the shit that, is this a South Red Agate? A gate? Oily texture. I don't know. I'm gonna have to really, I need another gemstone book because this book isn't telling me anything because it's, it doesn't even have, it's, this is not a smoky quartz because uh, a smoky quartz that I've always known was to be a smoky quartz was a grayish because it looked like smoke. This does not, if this is supposed to be a smoky quartz, it's wrong. It says it's a brownish, brownish gray translucent variety of quartz that ranges from ranges in clarity from almost completely transparency to almost opaque brownish gray and black crystals. So this is brown. It is opaque. It's not like 100% clear. That's not a smoky quartz. I have, I know what smoky, I have smoky quartz. It's, I think it's trolling me. I think the crystal box is trolling me. All right, I went ahead and I just put my coffee in before I started. I have to add water. Every want to piss in my Cheerios today. Today's been awful. Just with the attitudes. Anyway. Oh, so as I was saying, my day at the mall. <laughs> so, um, so like I said, we got to the mall. We went in through the Burlington. It was the biggest Burlington. I wouldn't, I wanted to vlog in there and show you guys there was so many people like people kept bumping into me they kept bumping into best friend they kept bumping into wifey like they didn't know how to say excuse me number one it was so jam-packed in that mall granted it's the week the week before christmas exactly one week till christmas of course all the stores and then the push people the one guy's like oh man sir can i look at your shoes talking to my son i said no you can't and he's like, oh, okay. I said, like, he was like literally following us. He's like, man, those are some nice shoes. Can I look at your shoes? Can I take your shoes for a minute? No, fuck off, you know? And then it was like, then the one lady, she like snagged best friend and she's like, oh, do you straighten your hair? Do you blow dry your hair? And it's just like, everybody was like all up in everybody's face. Like you couldn't walk past one of those little kiosks and have somebody all up in your face, all up in your face. I was like, what in the fuck is going on here? It was insanity. And like, I get it. Oh, and I went to my first Lego store. I never been to a Lego store before. That place was really cool, but it's got to be very anxiety filled because wall to wall people. Okay. But it was so cool. I had a little bit of footage as you probably have already seen. Um, but yeah, it was for the most part of I me mean, it was a good day it was fun it was nice but yeah so I mean it was just water wall people I did go to the five below because the five below was where I have been wanting to go anyway and that five below was like a little bit bigger because it's like in a mall and but they didn't really have shit I feel like this year shopping has been horrible like they've just put out like the worst piddly ass shit ever and it's just like Nothing was fitting my fancy. Nothing was like really catching my attention, grabbing, grabbing my attention, like nothing, like nothing at all. And I'm like, well, this is bogus. This is extremely bogus. So I'm going to use this. I'm like, it does. It, it, it genuinely sucked. And I was just like, well, this is, this is awful. 
So then we went there and then hubby and wifey went to TJ Maxx. We did go to the lunchbox store. That store is just, it's so cool to go in. I went to Hot Topic. I went to Spencer's because I was looking for something, but they didn't have it there. I do that every night. Just that little sip will get me through the rest. Oh, I spilled. I never spill. Look at Luda looking like, bitch. I never spill my coffee. But yeah, so it was just a madhouse. Um, it, I probably would not. Oh, wait a minute, hold on. Okay. <clears throat> they are waiting for. Look, both of them. Luna here. Callie there. Nixie. Loki. Okay. I gave them all their minnows. But anyway, like I was saying, like it probably would not have been as bad if I genuinely wasn't looking for something because last year we went to the mall, we literally went, we had lunch and um, and then we just walked around and like pissed off. Like we didn't really buy anything, but, but yeah. So me and uh, Brayden, we got lunch at the food court. We got Popeyes. I haven't had Popeyes. Popeyes used to be my favorite chicken place. And I grew up with Popeyes. The red beans and rice, the mashed potatoes and gravy. Oh, Popeyes is the shit. But I haven't had Popeyes in so long. I, ha I was like a chicken tender and a quarter in and my stomach started making the most wicked noises that I've heard that, like the noises that I used it used to make at the beginning of weight loss surgery like like after like right after I had it and I used to make it, it I was like mm -mm. so I didn't eat them and it was expensive it was almost $30 for two chicken strips like two meals it's wicked okay I sat down I bought myself A precision screwdriver set because I brought toys for work that need these motherfuckers. I'm tired of not having them. So you just have to go in my work bag. And that does a five below too. I'm going to wear it tomorrow with my outfit. My mad about plaid outfit. So... Tomorrow's the start of Spirit Week. Tomorrow's Mad About Plaid, which I believe tomorrow's color is white or something, which works in perfectly with my color of the day. So, <clears throat> I'm going to um, I am going to to do that. I'm going to wear that with um, my Jack Skellington light up shirt with my plaid leggings. And so I thought that would be super cute. And then my plaid shoes. I do have a plaid. Um, oh, I have a plaid, a plaid jacket. Maybe I'll wear my plaid jacket tomorrow. And I'll be like all plaid out. Maybe that's what I'll do. I got this for... One of my besties. So I got this. It was a whipped cream wreck. So I got that for her for Christmas. And oh my God, I found these. I wanted to get all of them, but I just didn't have the money. It's the world's smallest Hot Wheels. Look at Bone Shaker. Can you guys see? See how tiny this car is? You can't take them out, but oh my gosh. So I got three of them. Got that one. We got that one. Oh my God, they're so tiny. They're so cute. They had a bunch of them. I was like, I just thought they were so cool. And then there was that one. They had a ton of them. I wanted to get them all. I was like, oh my gosh, I love these. I love these so much. And then... 
I got this for my for one of the teachers that I work well I don't work with her directly all day every day but I did work with her for quite a few years I was in her classroom and she loves Alice in Wonderland and I'm sure you guys have seen me make things for her and stuff that's all Alice but I just thought this was the cutest thing ever and it's like kind of vintage but it actually has um tea bags in it so it's new english tea it's alice in alice's adventures in wonderland english breakfast tea so i just thought it was super totes adorable so i got that for her and then i also got where is my work feature these before but I got them the black ones but this time for the cost of two black ones I just got them a multi-pack of different colors for the same price so whatever color fits his fancy for the day he can use it so because he used it a lot so I got him a whole five pack but I don't know if I should take it and give it to him early or if I should wait so I also tried to look at books, books a million, books a million, and um, to get a calligraphy set for my girlfriend's daughter, and they didn't have any. Oh, this, this is from Brayden to Wifey. It's a little, it's a squishmallow penguin okay what else <gasps> oh best friend she's like you have a lot of presents to unwrap already can I just give this to you now I saw this at that new age store that was at the mall and I was like oh my god I was like this is so pretty and her and Brayden were in there. And it's a genuine stone. It's like a lapis lazuli. Look at this triple moon goddess. Mother maiden crone. Is this not absolutely stunning and gorgeous? Look at this. I want to hang it so you guys can like see it. I might maybe take the chain off and hang it above the doorway. I don't know, but I, this needs to get hit. This needs to get All right, I'll really quickly show you the rest of my Burlington haul. I got this for my teacher that I work with. That's so why I'm like, do I just give it to him now? Like these and that? Like, should I just give them to him now or just wait? Which I think I might wait. And then I got these for the teacher I worked with last year. And then oh, they had these Girl Scout Thin mint candy canes. What? And then these are for my other work bestie. I have to wrap them. It is Believe in the Light. It's a beautiful wall hanging. And look. It's like so gold and glittery. It is gorgeous. Look at that. Believe in the Light. And then... It was only $7.99. And then I got, this one says Saved by Grace. Isn't that pretty? It's so gorgeous. Oh, I thought they were so pretty. And they were only, like I said, $7.99. I need to get these price tags off. But oh, they're so pretty. I was like, yes, I need to get those. 
immediately for her because she's a big, um, you know, Christian faith and, you know. So I had to get them. I had to get them for her. So I need to wrap those. I did get, they had, Walmart had a light up cornhole set on clearance for like 30 bucks. This set I believe was like $70. $30 on clearance. I maxed out my Walmart credit card so I can buy it for my son and basically for the family um, for Christmas. So in the summertime, because we like to play cornhole. So yeah. And I want to taste one of these. You all want to taste one? We'll taste test one real quick. All right, we are in. All right. Now I don't know if these are going to be stale or not. Or not stale. Mm. They're delicious though. Mmm. I lied. They are so chewy. <laughs> We're my kind of candy cane. Alright, let's do the Christmas countdown. It's after 11. We'll do the Christmas countdown and wrap her up. Ready? Seven days till Christmas. One week. One week. Hi, right, guys. Please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And as always, Please be kind. Cause you don't know what kind of battle someone's going through. So don't be a dick. Okay? Okay, thanks. Alright guys. I love you all oh so oh so oh so very much. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. One week away.